Today, I'm excited to introduce you to the Lantis Hyperscale All Flash Hyperconverged Appliance. Let's take a look at how easy it is to set up. After you power on the first time, you are greeted by the Atlantis Hyperscale Welcome Screen, which walks you through a few basic steps to get up and running. Just click the Begin button and the intuitive user interface guides you through the process. First, you enter your location, time zone, and password. Second, you input your networking information for both your storage and management network. Once entered, click on the Submit button to kick off the configuration process. The Hyperscale installer takes care of completing the configuration of the VM manager, hypervisor, and storage volume in under 20 minutes. When everything is ready, you can log in to the Atlantis USX manager to get started using your new hyperconverged infrastructure. Now, let's go get some VMs set up on the infrastructure. On this appliance, we are using VMware vSphere, but could have also chosen to use Citrix Zen Server. You create new virtual machines the same way you always have by giving it a name and selecting the networking, storage, and operating system. As you see, the virtual machine is all configured, running on an all-flash hyperconverged storage volume. Next, let's check out the performance of this all-flash solution. For this, we have installed Iometer to our Windows virtual machine and configured it to run a server virtualization-like workload, featuring 4K blocks at 50% read, 50% write, with 80% random. Let's play it. You can see the amazing performance at over 160,000 IOPS with less than 0.6 milliseconds average read-write latency. Remember, this is performance right out of the box. Next, we're going to show how you can clone hundreds of VMs in minutes. Atlantis Hyperscale features Fast Clone, providing the capability to instantly provision full clone virtual machines in seconds without consuming additional storage capacity. To demonstrate this, we're going to clone one virtual machine 100 times using the Atlantis USX Manager. Let's switch over to vSphere Client for a second to see how fast that is happening. You can see that full clones are being created in a matter of seconds. It took an average of just 4 seconds for each VM to be fully cloned. Let's boot up a virtual machine to show that they're really there. It only takes 11 seconds to fully boot the machine. IT infrastructure doesn't get much easier or faster than what you've just witnessed. Disruption is here. Are you ready? Atlantis, the new order of storage freedom.